What's up everyone? Today we will be discussing the featherweight championship bout between Mikey Garcia and Juan Manuel Lopez. Man did Mikey Garcia disappoint me. For starters, when Mo wanted the fight at 128 pounds catch with, but Mikey denied it and wanted to fight at the featherweight limit. He then comes in at 128, 2 pounds over the limit. That was absolute shit on Mikey Garcia's part. To reject the catch with, and coming at that weight is disgraceful. That caused one to drop to 126 pounds. <laughs> but man oh man, it wouldn't have mattered anyway. One looked absolute shot. Mikey is a very accurate puncher, so one's non-existent defense made it too easy for Mikey. The first round was close, with one actually landing a couple straight lefts. Then, in the second round, he was toast. He kept lunging in with no head movement, and got picked off. In the second, a straight right put one on his ass. He finished the round. In the third he was blasted with hooks. He somehow stayed on his feet. <laughs> By this time, Juan looked done. The entire fight he was all over the place, off balance like hell. Shit, he was just lunging and asking to get punched flush with no head movement. In the fourth round, he was under fire again. He left himself wide open, and... Whoa! He got smacked with a flush left hook that laid him out on the floor, as if crucified. He at least tried to get up, showing heart through his technical flaws. He was out in round 4. Mikey Garcia is a sound boxer with great power for the featherweight division. What's next for Mikey? Hopefully big fights with either Abner Mars, or possibly Nonito Tanir. Maybe he could even fight Gamboa. As for Wenma, it was fun while it lasted. <laughs> Sadly this looks like the end. He was an exciting fighter, and maybe he has something left in him. Let's just hope that Mikey will come into his next fight making weight, because that was weak. Other than that, he's got big things ahead with trainer Robert Garcia. That is all.